Hello guys and welcome to another video from Vintage Radar. Today I'm going to show you how to set the time and date on your Casio G-Shock watch. Today we have the Casio GA100 that features the module 5081 as you can see right here. This is going to work for other Casio G-Shock watches as well. For example, the Casio, it has the same features when it comes to setting the time and date. Now the first thing that you want to do is to press and hold the adjust button for around 3-4 seconds. So let's do that. You are going to hear a small beep and then you are going to see your home city beeping, so flashing. We are going to use the mode button in order to toggle between different options. So I'm going to press it once. We are going to arrive at the DST. I'm going to press it once again and here we can select between 12 hour display and 24 hour display. I personally prefer the 24 hour display but you can use the forward button so the bottom pusher in order to switch between 12 hour display and 24 hour display. As you can see now we have 6 p.m. I'm going to press it once again. We are going to arrive at the 24 hour display and now we can see that we have 18. I'm going to press the mode button once again. Here we can reset the seconds. Now something really important is that if you reset the seconds between 30 and 59, you are going to reset them to zero, but the minute is going to be added. Let's see that. As you can see, we now have 19, but if we reset the seconds between one and 29, they are going to reset to zero without adding a minute. So let's also see that. As you can see, no minute has been added. I'm going to press the mode button once again. Now we can adjust the hours. Now we are going to be able to use both buttons. So I can also use the top pusher, the reverse button in order to go backwards. So as you can see right here, you can also press and hold any of the two buttons in order to speed scroll. This is very useful in case you want to set the minutes or the day of the month. I'm going to press the mode button and now we can adjust the minutes. I'm going to use the same feature, so the speed scroll in order to move faster. You can also go backwards or one by one in case you want to adjust it just a little. Now I'm going to press the mode button once again and here we can set the date. As you can see the first thing that I can set is the year. Once again I can use the reverse button and the forward button and the speed scroll is also available. Now I'm going to leave it at 2024. Now I'm going to press the mode button once again and now I can set the month. You can always use the speed scroll function and also you can go backwards. So let's make it December. I'm going to press it once again and let's make it the 24th of December. So just like that. Once you have set the time and date, you can press the adjust button in order to end the process or you can use the mode button in order to toggle through the options and start all over again. And let's say you want to um, set the minutes once again because you made a mistake, you do that. And after everything is correct, you can press the adjust button and you are done. Now the analog time is going to match the digital time. So guys, that is how you set the time and date on your Casio G-Shock watch. I'm going to have a full guide on how to use all the functions and features on this particular model. So the GA100, I'm going to leave a link in the description below. So make sure to check it out. And if you found value guys, make sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to this YouTube channel, comment, let me know what you would like to see next. And if you want to see more videos about watches, vintage watches, watch tutorials and watch unboxing videos, guys, once again, subscribe. See you on the next one.